there. Y'all kept a girl waiting. Now, which one's the prince? Aha! Hello, your highness. Congrats on your wedding. Not hitch just yet. Lady Luna Freya's groom to be here in Hammerhead. Apologies for taking so long. <laughs> you best save your apologies for Papa. Well, that makes you. Cindy. Sid's grease monkey granddaughter. Roll her in while I'm still young. Didn't your daddy tell you? She's a custom classic, not some beat up old clunker. Prince Noctis. Uh, yeah. Prince. Like they took your old man and kicked the dignity out of him. What? You got a long way to go, son. And that slack jaw's getting you nowhere fast. She's gonna take a while. Y'all get her in and run along. <sighs> Y'all heard him. Let's get moving. Right this way. Now, we play the waiting game. Uh, never liked that game. Never any good at it either. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'll be playing some Final Fantasy 15. And uh, this game um, is one of the games I did enjoy. I'm a big Final Fantasy fan, so looking forward to seeing how the RTX 3090 performs. Playing at a resolution of 3840 by 2160. No V-Sync, but the game does have a frame cap of 120 frames per second. 100% resolution means I'm playing at the native resolution selected. Assets on means that the HD texture pack has been also enabled. And everything is maxed out apart from disabled motion blurs, I just don't like it. And Nvidia VXAO, not part of the highest preset, but it's an option if you wish to enable a higher quality ambient inclusion. It's about 20 FPS hit, not worth it in my opinion. But I'll see if the RTX 3090 can handle it potentially in a separate video. But for now at least, I'm just going to explore um, what this card can do with this type of game. Now, this is an open world RPG, so um, I will be trying to travel around and seeing what areas um, will uh, tank the performance. Uh, this area is quite safe, so there's not really going to be too much going on. I'm just going to quickly talk with Cindy here and get the uh, story going. Y'all ain't never been out this way before, have you? Go on, have a look around. This will make sure y'all don't get lost. I well, might as well make good use of the extra time. So you kind of unrolls at the start of the game. They got Ebony out here. Then you get to start exploring oh, after that. Flip. Wait, oh, uh, what's a gill? So this is kind of a new game plus of sorts for me as I've already I've already beat the game. And uh, I've got loads of items, so I don't really need to buy anything. Need to uh, speak to uh, Ignis. You do have to kind of speak to the shopkeeper at least to kind of get the story to continue. Well, a moment knocked. We've expended the last of our funds on the repairs. I suggest we confer with Cindy. Broken down and flat broke. Adding insult to injury. Old man's in for both after charging us that much. Yeah, let's pay him a visit. So getting a ridiculous amount of performance at the moment, 100 frames or close to that, which is very impressive. She ain't gonna be ready for a while. Y'all need something? Yeah, we need to borrow a loan. Hate to ask, but can we borrow some cash? Oh, now I get it. This must be what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them boys a lesson. Told me he ought to have y'all take care of some ornery varmints that have been causing a ruckus around here. I'd be happy to pay y'all for your services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? All according to Sid's plan. I say we play along, 
and teach him not to underestimate us. But don't go running around after dark. The demons are liable to rip y'all to shreds. Here, this ought to be enough for a place to stay. Just between us, though. Don't tell Papa. Okay, so I can finally get going. Uh, let's see what the performance is like when we get good out in the open. I'm using 13 Gladio, come on. Gotcha. gigabytes of RAM. Now, this game does use a lot of memory. Um, and I'm finally happy to have a car that exceeds... 11 gig or elite exceeds 12 gigabytes. Sorry, on the Looks Nvidia like side of things. Targets. Ready, knocked. So, like, I'm just way overpowered for these guys right now, so I'll take them out fairly quickly. Excellent work. On we go. Game's performing well so far, though, getting around. 80 frames per second. The RTX 3090 just brute forcing his way uh, through this here? game. The telegraph pole's been split in two. And not just this one either. The hell do you think did this? Hard to say. Natural disaster, perhaps? You sure? The hammerhead doesn't have a scratch on it. Maybe a huge monster came and knocked him down. It better not be the varmint Cindy was talking about. The game does suffer from hitching and stuttering, which is a bit annoying. Uh, it's not too bad at the moment, but um, it's something that kind of ruined the fluidity of the game. Anyone who's played this game at these types of settings at native 4K will know that this is uh, actually very, very good performance right now. These guys are no match for me, so I'll dispose of them as quickly as I can. Done in no time. Yeah, this is Let's really, really it. light work for the RTX 3090 at the moment. I'm actually, um, you'd only get this type of performance if you use DLSS. So, uh, where are we headed anyway? Nowhere until the repairs are done. Then we head for Golden Key. Then after that, we hop a boat, and before you know it, lover boy's hitched. Wait for car repairs, then wedding bells in the air. Got it. Yeah, so you'd need to use DLSS to get anywhere close to this with the RTX 2080 Ti while being overclocked. But uh, the fact that I'm doing this kind of performance at native is uh, almost there. It's quite uh, breathtaking for me, all. to be honest. So I might even be off to enable VXAO and see how much of a performance it takes. And I'll do that in a separate video, as I said. I don't want to change anything now. Camera knocked. Don't count on it. I think that's nice. all of the complete. That's all of the monsters that she wanted me to kill. Hello? Hey, it's Cindy. How goes the hunting? Actually, we just finished. That's great, because I got one more hunt for y'all. Only this time, it's for a person. Fella named Dave went off, and we ain't heard from him since. Reckon he staked out a spot in an old shack nearby. Old shack? Oh, got it. We'll take a look. So we got to go and find this some so, what did Dave guy. Say? Needs us to find some Dave guy. He went missing? Not missing. Said he's holed up in that shack. So again, what I meant about the stuttering is still present. Um, it's annoying, but it seems to not be as prevalent um, as present with this this card. At least maybe it's a memory memory issue. Um, I really wish they would fix that for any future Final Fantasy games oh, they bring out this? on the PC. So in some cutscenes it will dip okay? below 20 yeah, FPS for some reason. I'm not too sure why that is. Do it. Hey, what about the shack over there? Okay, let's get out of here now. The game is on rails at the start, so you do have to kind of 
just follow and then eventually you start kind of getting to do what you want. Let's take these guys out. Not yet. Got a plan. So I can kind of ambush these guys and uh, get the advantage. trouble. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them varmints. I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Yeah, why not? Oh, yeah, we'll take care of it. Y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw him. Way to show some spunk. Now let's get ready to kick some tail. So I've got one more monster to kill before I can get my hands on the regalia. Then I'll see what the, uh, the performance is like on the road. But so far, so good. I'm actually uh, impressed with... Uh, the frame rate. Now there are little instances where the frame rate uh, drops down. It would be wise to rest up before we set out. But on the whole, it's actually okay. Um, I don't really care for resting up, so I'm just gonna keep going. Just remember, confidence will only take you so far. It's okay, Ignis. I'm way stronger than I should be at this point in the game, so we can kind of just get. To our destination. Sometimes I wonder if we'll ever sit inside that beautiful car again. Sitting most of the day was pretty nice. Napping was even better. So Final Fantasy, I believe 16 has been announced, so hopefully that performs a lot better uh, when it comes to PC. In terms of just like the optimization, the smoothness. But the game with, with this graphics card, at least, huh. is performing That's okay in this area. Yes, but not your run of the mill breed. We best make quick work of it. And okay, we need to try and take this out. Wait a sec. What? Scared, big guy? You ought to be too. Things vicious. You sure. Looks tame to me. Yeah. Look out! Nice one. It's not over yet. Ready for round two. It's time. Bring it. Alright, I'm gonna try and ambush it. You're mine. Oh man, Gladio just killed it straight away. That's how powerful my team is. Didn't even get to didn't even get to strike ring, it. Ring. Hello? Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Ken? Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. Oh, while I got ya. If y'all want to fix her up before you roll out, let me know. Sounds good. She'll be waiting at the garage. Gotcha. Okay, so I can get the car back now. So, so who's head back. next behind the wheel? Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Not sure I'd do any better. Put me in the driver's seat. Good. Because I need the leg room in back. As you can see the Asus Tough um, 
card is really really doing a great job with the thermals. I keep saying this in pretty much every video but um, it really does cool this card well and it's uh, crazy with the TDP as high as it is it still does um, a really really good job. The card is huge though. I haven't shown any pictures or videos with the card installed. I will do that at some point but the card is very very long but just about long enough to get so far, into my man, case. Our Crown City upbringing didn't prepare us for this. Uh, pretend you're walking to the car. So I was saying, yeah, just about long enough to get into my case without um, blocking off my reservoir for my uh, CPU um, cooling. Man, this place is far by foot. So as you can see, in the desert area, at least, the uh, RTX 3090 performs keep well. Waiting. You better apologize. Uh, uh, what is that? Whoa, a live hurricane that thing's like half bird half storm half airship you realize that's three halves well it explain its size <laughs> awesome in every sense you do actually get to fight one of those later on in the game that thing is huge though I think you can go down to the beach um, as early as um, where I am in the game. So I'm going to try and uh, get to a different location and see if it stresses the, the card in a different way. Right now, the opening scenes uh, seem to be no issue for uh, this setup, so I'm happy with that. The sultry, yeah. Okay, we're finally back. Let's go and get the regalia now. We're here. the wait ain't she pretty she's almost too pretty for the road she's back we should all get a picture with her all the more reason to ride with care Oh, and before I forget, would y'all mind making a little delivery for me? No, not at all. Perfect. Thought you'd say yes. So I already put it in the trunk. There should be a motel on your way to Galden. If y'all wouldn't mind giving that to the owner, that'd be swell. Grandpa like grandkid. Now that she's all polished up and ready for the road, would you care to take her for a little test drive, Noct? Um, well, I'll let Egan drive. I can't bother to. <laughs> Not sure I've got what it takes. I see. Then allow me to take the wheel. I'd rather just let Egan drive and just take in the scenery. Anyway, let's uh, move on. I don't want to fast travel. Everything in order? Yep. So you can change the view as well, so you don't need to be in the car itself. So while driving on a road, obviously, that doesn't tank performance either. Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. Ah, <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. 
I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! <laughs> uh, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own wheels. <laughs> Prompto is on Cindy. The guys are teasing her about teasing him about it. Very, very smooth. Almost using, well, using 15 gigabytes of uh, VRAM, which is just ridiculous. So even if you had a 16 gigabyte card, um, this game will be uh, definitely trying to make use of it, at least allocating it. What do you say we pull over for a minute? Yeah, my throat's bone dry. Sounds like grounds for a pit stop. Sounds like a waste of time and money. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? Okay, so I've got a delivery to make. I think it's this person over here I've got to speak to. You all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, thank you kindly. We'll take it out of the trunk so you all just sit tight. Umbra, bringing us stuff. Had a boy. A dog can really track a scent. Certainly knows how to find us. How do you always know, boy? Just a sec. Nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah, sill blossoms. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure, that's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. So him and Lady Luna Frey are like pen pals or something. Very cute. I'll just use the default option. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> you don't say. Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden. Right, so I'm gonna head to Golden Queen just to go to a different area just to see how uh, the game performs. Again, you can kind of just auto travel. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fast travel, so so we can take in a bit more scenery. Everything in order. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm very impressed by the performances. Well truffled that. I mean, this game is very, very demanding. Um, For our next story, Lady Luna Freya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace, nor the pride I take in my betrothal playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages, as you always have, and I shall continue to bless you all. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming days. Please be advised that during this time alone, her duties as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And not to your likes. Hey! I see the sea! I see it too. That's Golden Key. Kinda wanna go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. 
Nobody goes to Galden for an island, though. They go to kick back and get massages. Can't say with the seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. Okay, finally here. Golly, it does look pinked out, man. That wouldn't be it's a bad card to actually have in the modern day. It pales in comparison to old Tisha. Seriously? Okay, so there are some like uh, monsters and stuff just roaming around. So I'm gonna try and find a fight to get into, just to see if the performance is any different around here. The terrain's similar, so I'll do some other videos where it's like more foliage, more uh, foresty areas, and uh, and truly see the turf works in effect. So that way we can kind of see if it can still maintain this type of performance. And I'll also enable um, VXAO as well, just to see what type of performance it can provide. But uh, we've got a few guys over here that I may as well just take out very quickly. Because they're really armored, I'm gonna try use the bigger sword. I've got my uh, special anyway, so I can just kill these guys off. Like I said, I'm like ridiculously overpowered. Onward, right. No problem. So as you can see, the the game just works flawlessly on the uh, RTX 3090. If you have a look at the VRAM now, you're looking at 16.7 uh, gigabytes of VRAM being used. So this game can use an incredible amount of, of memory. Um, I don't know if it's a memory leak or if it's just allocating it, but uh, that's that's the highest memory usage I've seen in any game. So uh, I think I'll leave it there. Thanks very much for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.